What's up everybody? Hope you're doing super well. If you're new here, my name is Ryan and I'm entirely honest, I hope to improve your life by sharing the ways that I improve mine. And in this video, I want to talk a little bit about reading, specifically how I read to best extract knowledge out of the books I'm reading and apply what I learn to my day-to-day -day life. So it's a pretty simple note-taking system that I use and it's not too complicated, so I'll just explain it in this video and hopefully you guys can get some value out of it. Let's get started. So I already made a video explaining why I read and I'll link to it right up here. But in this video, I want to talk about more specifically how I read. And it might seem like a simple thing, like you just read a book, but up until I developed this note-taking system for reading, I would usually just read a book and then kind of finish it and then just kind of forget about it. Forget about it. I would never really open it again or go to reference to it. It was kind of just like in one ear and kind of out the other. And I really didn't retain that much knowledge. So there has been some techniques that I've developed that actually help me to apply what I'm learning in books uh, to my day-to-day -day life and then also help me just to better um, understand and extract the knowledge from the book itself. So the first thing that I do, and I haven't been doing it as much lately as I used to, but it's normally during the summer months or like basically any time where it's, you can walk outside and your hands aren't going to get cold, is I'll usually walk and read at the same time. And it sounds kind of crazy, but there's actually some science behind it. It's um, when you're walking, your blood flow is just a lot better than when you're stationary. And you have more blood flow to your brain and your brain basically works better and you're able to better extract what you're reading and better understand it and retain it. So I love walking and reading at the same time. It's just also like a super nice activity. And um, yeah, it's just, uh, it's something that I do and a lot of people make fun of me for it, but it works super well. So that's like kind of like my first thing that I do for reading. But the second thing that I like to do is to um, mark notes while I'm reading. So I read with a mechanical pencil. Uh, this is a really nice Graph Gear 1000, um, but it's just like a regular mechanical pencil. And when I'm reading, if I find a quote in the book that I really like, I will mark that sentence or that paragraph or whatever it is that I like. And then later on, depending on the length of the book and how important the book is, if I'd like to reference it in the future, I'll take all those things that I marked in the book and I'll create a digital notes um, in my notes app so that I can refer to those uh, digital notes any time I want and on any device that I want. So um, a really good example of one that I do quite frequently is um, my first book review, which is How to Win Friends and Influence People. That's a really great book on communication. And I like to review the notes for that book before I do like, go to like a social event or I'm gonna hang out with like friends or family. If I really wanna just put my best self forward, I'll take like 10, 15 minutes to review the book notes of that book. And it really helps me just in my uh, social scenarios. So yeah, that's kind of like a brief summary of my, um, my note taking method for reading. And, and uh, yeah, that's, so that's about how I read. I just want to make this quick video this week. I hope uh, you guys get some value out of it. And that's it for this week. So thank you guys again so much for watching. I really appreciate your support and your comments. I'm almost at 100 subscribers, so that's going to be awesome when we get there. And that's about it. So please give the video a like, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you next week. Thanks so much and have a great day. Peace.